Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Muckle Lover, and thank you for joining me here to start a new campaign in Vanilla Hoy 4, somewhat using a special mod called MCAP America, in which we, of course, are playing as FDR right now, but we do have a, another part of the focus tree now that gives us capitalism first, but it's already March 10th, 1936, so we've got to wait a little bit before we get there. So, War Plan is Division. All we might is our peace, we must prepare for war. Oh, wow, just like historical. Even though I'll, I will let you know right now, this is definitely not on historical. So we'll see what happens. You never know what's going to happen here. Uh, Italy was all just war plans. Planning speed five percent. Oh, come over here first. War Department. In age of industrialized warfare, we must have an ad administration capable of harnessing the resources of our great nation to their fullest potential. Now we just have to wait till the election so we can start going with the reestablish the gold standards. So we have to get rid of FDR. But in the meantime. Uh, we can't do this either because we need more representatives and senators. Uh, this is not too bad. Cost reduction, better fire production, which is not bad. Strategic bombing, escort fighters, build the Pentagon, which is okay. Department of Defense, which is not bad. You get more daily command power gain, which is actually pretty nice. Especially with only 6% war support. Selective, you can't even do this one too, so maybe we'll just build the Pentagon. The expansion of our military requires a new global headquarters to command it, which is okay. Um, so, you know, got a lot of things down this way. The old deal. Huh. Empowering businesses. Or business. Limit government intervention. Liberty for all. A business federation, eh? <clears throat> An ethical institution. <laughs> Private defense. We're going to need a lot of senators and representatives. Private armies. End of the state. Oh. Yeah. Business in the Americas. In which we need to destabilize Mexico and Canada. Our favorite things. Oops, I forgot about Ethiopia. I guess, then again, I guess a lot of people do as well. Oh yeah, that's fine. Whatever. The real initiative. That's okay. I guess we could... Eh, well, I guess small lobbying effort. We lose political power. We'd actually lose a lot of political power. Um... i eh, do it anyways. Senator votes for government proposal. If you want to read about that, please go ahead. Nice. Alright, and we're going to re really be working on our naval doctrines here. Speak passion for support of government. She is right, you know. Alright, and... Carrier organization? Why not? <clears throat> now let's get some death charges. We'll grab some what? We could grab some tanks. Anything here? Oh, yeah. This person industry will go with that one for now. Are we losing any put power yet? No, we didn't actually choose that. War Department's nice. Actually, I might even just do a focus. Just because... Um, you lose so much political power. Great Depression kind of sucks, not going to lie. Small lobbying. Uh, actually, do we have enough support? We should have enough support already. Oh, we need... Oh, we need way more reps. Way more reps. Honestly, I might just save up political power. And grab. Oh, we also have Henry Ford. Give more political power and ANCAP Drift. The Business Federation here. Howard Hughes is not bad from ANCAP Drift. Uh, oh, and pretty much everyone else is pretty much the same. I do want to get, though, Editor. That's not terrible, too. America First. Um, Robert Taft would be good. I want extra political power. We need extra political power. We get some statehood. Initially, we support the government. We get some cores. Puerto Rico. The normal stuff. Of course, manage subjects. By territories. Civilian oversight, local autonomy for now, and cavalry divisions are fine enough for now, too. As we should be training lots and lots of the Navy. Yeah. Oh, are they guys done training? No, you're going to train until you're dead. This is America. We got more than enough fuel for everybody. There you go. Cool. Because we need that naval XP. We don't really need to have it, but it's, not, it's nice to have. Uh, Eisenhower, anything here, anything here? Federal planner is probably the way to go. I don't think we can get involved in the Spanish Civil War. We do have 36 divisions. That's the last time I actually played as Vanilla USA, but it's not even Vanilla. <clears throat> and we knew our world tension, which sucks. After we build the Pentagon, of course, Department of Defense. Our, rename the War Department underlines that we can no longer choose to ignore our protection until the moment's tested. We must always be vigilant. And we're literally just here to get some more uh, command power. That's it. Uh... Oh. God, that's so bad. How do we get rid of the Great Depression? We could just do continue the New Deal, but no. We gotta wait till the elections. Limit intervention. WPA. Suspend the persecution. But that's fun. That's fun persecuting people. What do you mean? So, oh, nice. More reps. That's pretty good. I would honestly, if I could, I, I'd do this first. So, getting those extra dockers would be very nice. War, war plans, selective training. Oh, oh, nice. More senators, too? Sure, we'll take more senators. Land cost reduction, Sport Rock Island. Just a bunch of blueprints. 
don't know, I remember when America got like an updated tree. Is this an updated tree? But like, after seeing Spain and a lot of the other trees, I'm like, this could be updated further even more. I have a ship hole. I don't think we can really make too much out of this because we have a we're part limited by the Navy thing, right? I think. Uh, fire control, nothing there, which kind of sucks. Do we have actually a 1936? No, we don't. Dang it. Uh, secondary batteries. Oh, production costs us be less than a thousand. So we probably can't throw this on there, yeah. How much can we actually throw on? Aircraft. Oh, that's dangerously close. Actually, we'll change this to. No. Dude, that sucks. That would help reduce it. Change this to. Oh, come on, man. Yeah. Battle Ooh, Battle Cruiser Armor 2. Make some Battle Cruisers to get a little more speed. Uh, you, you don't lose that much armor, honestly. You get a little more health. Uh, Battle Cruisers aren't really worth it as much, I think. Hmm. There we go. No, no, that's fine. We'll do it. Why not? I would just call them Battle Cruisers. Because it, it's literally just Battle Cruiser armor. So. All right, might as well. Oopsie. Hello. Goodbye. And these carriers. Goodbye. We'll start making more stuff, of course. Three more things here. Destroyers. It's nice. It's nice getting a lot of naval XP. Super, super nice. Come on, let's have the elections. Please let us have the elections. The Democratic tree. Yeah, FDR. Just likes Germany. Well, that's nice. Spain is doing okay, actually. <clears throat> We saw long, we'll see how long we last, though. Yeah, I'm gonna get more political power first. Like, well, experiments are fine. Uh, death charge lowers are nice. Get some extraction. We're gonna need some chromium. Plane wise, we're doing well in planes, actually. Oh, I forgot about research. I forgot about research. How did I forget about that type of research? I'll grab two things from them. Even though we're just building up a bunch of civvies now, we might as well keep doing it. So, Department of Defense, and then Aerial Plans Divisions, yeah. To make the right priorities in aviation as well as aircraft production will require a long-term plan. The AWPD will ensure that we have material organization strategic plans. And then after that, we should be able to decide re-establishing the gold standard, right? Without the gold standard, money exists as little more than an article of faith, while rampant inflation eats away at our people's savings and devalues their work. What's ban this fiscally irresponsible path? Hmm, not cruisers. Naval targeting. Nice. Oh, we actually do have quite a bit of manpower, too. We're trying to make some more divisions as well. Marines. They're not that thick. Darn it. Garrison Brigades. Yeah, they're, they could be worse. Actually, we have the National Guard, which is not terrible to combat with. You should convert these three to, like, ooh, um, artillery. But, the election of 36. The day of presidential elections robbed, income FDR has already implemented several of the programs referred collectively to as a New Deal and tend to take the U.S. out of the Great Depression. <clears throat> While many of the efforts have been popular, his plans further extend the role and power of the government have met, been met with criticism from his opponent, Republican Alf Landon. Coming from the oil industry, Landon wants to see great economic freedom, while Roosevelt and the Democratic Party want to expand Social Security and ensure economic stability. Election may be a close call or a major victory for Democrats. Four more years. <coughs> New Deal, get more construction stability, huh? Safeguard safeguard that deals with the American system. The momentum gained from the presidential elections is likely to carry over to the congressional elections as well. We get political power and Senator Oil of California. Oh, whoops. With well, the new president now in office, the former opposition in Congress has largely shifted to support the new administration. President Alf Landon can come out and support 50 senators and 30, 335 representatives. The people have spoken, my friends. <clears throat> but Alf, are you going to stay there for long? That's a good question. A very good question, actually. Oh, Dominion's break with the crown. Oh, boy. Oh, dispersed. We love it, dispersed. I'll oh, go and grab that one, too. We need that one. Keep doing what you're doing. Oh, more civvies. Even though we technically... 37 is better than... Oh, we're going about this. Please go right ahead. Nation is plant Missouri. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, better than some of the starting states in uh, the entire game. Oh, the criticizing the president. Oh, come on, guys. Why are you criticizing us? We just got here. We literally just got here. <laughs> 50, so... Oh, we could actually grant statehood now if we really wanted to. Do I want to? There's not much else we can do with our... Oh, then again, we could grab some military staff. Yeah, getting all the political power stuff. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Eisenhower. Eisenhower would be pretty good. Um, is this worth it? 
for 30, 40 days? Probably not. Alaska! And reestablish a gold standard. Follow it up with... Whee. Capitalism first. FDR's New Deal was once quite popular, but Alf's electoral success shows a shifting in American popular opinion. Many Americans, weary of the Depression, look back at the Gilded Age and wish for America to return to that time of isolationism and... Great. Uh, oh, come on. In industrial success. We've got a lot of things to build, man. Only need 22,000 guns, that's all. Just a casual 22,000. Production, yeah. I mean, at least we're doing okay and everything else, pretty much. Uh, you guys. What are we doing with... Oh, construction and stuff like that's not bad. Repairing, building. Oh, there goes Estonia. Nice. And well, I think at the time this recording, the subs are better. But once that's actually plays off London. So we have Poland. Because it's been so long since I've actually played. Well, not so long, but pretty... It's been a while since I've actually played. Um, vanilla. Austria still here. Kingdom of Hungary. And the Reich is going down with Germany for now, so... We'll see what happens with them. What's France up to... Well, they're fairly conservative or democratic for now. I was say conservative. I play too much TNO, man. <clears throat> How's the UK doing? Oh. Oh, they're in a change of course. Okay. China's doing, well, China things, I guess. They have a proving relations, huh? And Japan is still fascist. That's fine, whatever. Cool. Oh, capitalism first, yes, please. We get uh, Henry Ford, which I do want to get next. So... When's it change? Weekly stability goes down and cap drop goes up. Nice. We can't do America first, which I've never done, and I don't think I'll ever do it because the Civil War for vanilla for America sucks, and I I don't, I don't know if I want to do that. So, oh, we could, after that one, oh, maybe we should do adjusted the Compensation Act, Neutrality Act. Passing this will drastically increase the requirements to pass on this act. Senator retire. He'll be missed. Our own democracy is not bad either. Yeah, after that one, um, I think we'll definitely do the other one because we need more political power. Empower businessmen. We lose a lot of political power. Limited government intervention. We lose a ton of political power. Holy crap. Yeah, we don't want to wait for that one. Uh, just the Compensation Act. <clears throat> what? Presidential misconduct? What do you mean? Oh, there goes the Spanish Commune. Our veterans of the Great War promise a fair pension. Many have fallen on hard times recently since the Depression has hit. We must do what we can to help those who answer the call of the Republic and its hour of need. Cool. After 37, everybody. Oh, Pakistan and India are already killing each other. Well, it's a little early, I think. Ain't it? <clears throat> oh, the power of the kings. Okay. I hope we don't end up fighting both the UK and Amer and America, Germany at the same time. That'd be terrible. But that would certainly be something, wouldn't it? Mm, let me close that one up for now. Nation building the Philippines, no one cares. Ah, and Cap America as we're slowly losing stability under Alf London. Look at all the naval XP. I love it. We'll have, like, the best, like, naval doctrine when we go to war with anybody. Like, at least it'll be all done. Hmm, Labor Management Relations Act, Protectionist Tariffs. That's not bad, you. Income Tax Reform. Wow. Just wow. And I'd be good to get that, this one, too, but... After that one, we'll, we'll ping-pong back and forth. Uh, daily Communism Support. The Old Deal. Workers Marginalized. Oh, Chiang Kai-shek. Oh, that's not good. Military is gross suspicious. Uh, the U.S. military has a way of staying out of politics, yet some top journalists cannot look past seemingly anarchist values. Some prominent business figures entering politics are supporting. Whether or not these business leaders do anything too crazy, we'll need to make sure to up our support for the military. Oh. Civvies. Um, I'd rather lose... Uh, we lose output. We'll get more fact... We'll get more, oh, we need to... We, oh, there's nothing here. The old deal. We definitely need some uh, political power, though. Medium lobbying effort. Oh, wow. <clears throat> Not bad. Yeah. Yeah, we definitely need more. Oh, and there goes Carlos Spain. That really sucks for the nationalists. Spain might so beat Spain. You never know what the Spanish are up to. Spanish people are Spanish people. No comments. For now. For now. Oh, China clip. Well, I mean, that would do it. Yeah. The old deal. Please and thank you. Happy June, everybody. All right, let's see, what do we got here? No, I think we're good on naval stuff. I'm pretty good, okay, or at least okay on doing naval stuff. Um, so that stuff's okay, early... God dang it. Um, 
Cruisers are nice too. Let's just see if we can edit these just a little bit more. More anti-air. Fire control is fine. Get some sonar since that's the only thing we can do. Secondary. We have cruiser armor 3 already? That's kind of kind of impressive already. Um, and get rid of that. I want anti-sub stuff. Nice. There you go. Good enough. For 37, radar would be very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, continue. Oh, that's fine. Opposition to surface defeat. That's very nice. We still have, oh, we have more. Okay, that's nice. Um, yeah, these are oldies. We don't we don't like the moldies right now. Even though subs, yeah. Let's see more cruisers. It's fine. Which does require quite a bit of chromium, but... Yeah, four. Eh, we're okay. Oh, we must have got more support because we did the thing in uh, Missouri already. Actually... Oh, can you stop criticizing us? We ain't doing much here. We ain't doing much at all. Go two for that one. Fires will be fine. Bombers, Amelia Earhart's gone. The old deal. So then we're going to grab Henry Ford next. Oh, who's it? Victor Perlo. Yeah, I definitely need a uh, Henry Ford. Aspiring Yang Captain's not bad, too. But Henry Ford, he's a dude. <clears throat> Fourth International. Japan. Oh, well, Japan's probably going to die. And then, can we do this one? Uh, probably going to do that once we get down there as well. Minus 0.4 daily political power gain. Oh, my goodness. Probably Labor Management Relations Act. Um... This is all over America threatened by all kinds of union activities. Strikes are organizing demands for the high wages. We cannot allow this to continue. No, sorry. No, no, no. I fear this would not be bad, but... Worker riots. Old deal, new deal. Who even knows what's going on at this point? Workers are taking the streets again in response to what they perceive as a new ruling party on doing the new deal and taking advantage of the crisis. Well, that's nice, son. That's nice. <clears throat> Amend the budget, huh? Research grants, give refugees to German scientists and such like that. Mechanical computing is not bad. Better already. Um, honestly, probably just chief of the army would be really good. Give more daily army XP gain. Do we need it for anything else? I mean, we'll need it for like other things, such as these guys. I might go with him, maybe. We'll see. How long do we have this? I'm 38, that's fine. As long as the caps are growing faster than the Communist Party of the United States of America, we should be okay. Oh. More than 95% support. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Arsenal Democracy. Requires Neutrality Act. Limited Intervention. Okay. Scientist Haven's not bad too. They offer support. Build new munitions, munitions plant. Before I forget about that, let's go and do that too. Oh, this one's almost done too. Wow. Nice. Extraction because you can. We're going to need some serious rubber later. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. And now we can't do either one. We need way more support for the Republican Party. But, you know, we're not going down this way. So, as much as I like that one, the giant awakes. Which doesn't do much for us for 70 day focus. Oh my goodness. Wartime industry is not bad either, but these ones don't even matter. Um, military construction would be nice, but you can always build that stuff later. Projects, you can always get that stuff later. So honestly, this tree's not great. So actually going down this way is probably better overall. It really is. Empire businesses. Um, yeah, that's fine. Let's do that one. That'd be good. Some good old businesses. Communism's growing every day under Earl Browder. Not good. Oh, come on, sons. You sons of guns. I don't want to eliminate government intervention. We don't have that much political power anyways. Oh. <clears throat> a business federation, liberty for all. Um, does not have spirit neutrality act. Align key generals. Oh. Oh, so we do. I need to come down here pretty quickly then. Retire Eisenhower and get Courtney Hodges. Recruit mercenaries. Ooh. All right, so probably limit government intervention next time. Lose a little bit of political power, but that's the sacrifice we're willing to make. Followed up with Liberty for All. Uh, 70 focus is nothing here, which kind of sucks, but we'll see what we can do. Well, everyone, here we're at on August 27th, 1938. Canada's, well, Canadian. Oh, the Great Britain's back. Um, 
The Soviet Union had a civil war, and the Union of Soviet Republics is here, but unfortunately they're only led by Grigory Zinov Zinoviev. He's a born agitator, but we're doing the business federation. Um, I've gone ahead and done, like, military restructuring, which would be nice. Um, we already aligned key generals. We've done condemning socialism, as well as Vladivostok free zone. And we're doing the business federation next, but following that... We'll do uh, some protectionist tariffs. Free trade has opened up a market for foreign competition, many of which have raised tariffs and duties of their own. Our companies face stiff compensation or competition. While theirs enjoy the safety of the customs wall, this must end. With the outbreak of the war, wait, what? The Afghan government has officially informed the remaining signatories of the London Naval Treaty that under Article 24 considers the restrictions of the Naval Treaty to be no longer in the national interest. The Afghan ambassadors therefore announced that the Naval Treaty will be suspended for the duration of the war. Whether the restrictions will return into force after the war is over remains to be seen, but. For the time being, we should consider ourselves no longer bound by treaty obligations uh, when it comes to designing sh building ships. Wh what? It, it, it's a set Afghan, right? Oh, and we have the Business Federation. Oh. Alright, so. U.S. Business Federation seeks to establish a set of rules that fellow corporations willingly follow with their own betterment. Unfortunately, any business may be put out, pull out of this federation for any reason, leaving it extremely weak and unstable. I'll take an incomprehensible amount of effort to keep everyone's interests aligned. Increase minimum wage. Um... Decrease, decrease, decrease satisfaction. Increase vertical satisfaction by, by quite a bit. Uh, focus on the little guy. Worker and small business satisfaction does go well, which is not bad. Promote business elites. Massive infrastructure projects. All right. Well, that's not bad. I kind of like that one. You get two infrastructure, it gives you more resources. But it's not great, but yeah. Let's do that one. Nice. Not bad. And other than that, we've just been doing a lot of other stuff here. Protection stuff will be really nice. Income tax reform. I'd love to do that. I don't think we'll have enough because we'll lose. Actually, we actually might be able to do that immediately. The income tax money takes money out of every income tax takes money out of every American's wallet. It's money that our citizens should spend on buying other things and supporting the local economy. We'll give up the Americans' autonomy over their own finances back. And when oh, so when we get that, extend the tax breaks when it's removed. Okay. <clears throat> well, if we have to do this. We'll lose some stability. Eh, that's hard to do it anyways. Forty-five percent. Forty-five percent. That's fine. Focus on that. They're small guy. Small business grants. Senators speak out against us, of course. Why not? Mm. Escalator clause invoked. Getting more war probably going to be good, but we're actually already 40% war support, which is not bad. And we're almost done with the naval doctrine, technically, so. Pretty good overall. Pretty good. What are we doing here still? Put on some of this. Go to Missouri, might as well. Better radar is nice. It's almost 39. I think we'll wait to do stuff like that. We could get some of those tanks. Yeah, that one's okay to get. Logistics, definitely. Um, recon, anything else? 38, yeah, gun stuff would be nice to do as well. Yeah. Super heavy battleships. Well, since we got rid of that last thingy, I'll also do this too. We like them big and chunky. If they ain't big, we don't want them. Save it for now, unless I make a mistake later. These guys are going to be super slow, but whatever. Um, good secondary batteries. A lot of secondary batteries. Uh, more anti-air is okay. And we're only going to throw that many cannons on. These guys are really slow. Oh, we don't have enough. God dang it. We'll wait then. That's right. We're going to wait for a long time anyway for it, so it doesn't really matter. We'll lose some stability. Election to Congress. Oh, boy. Oh, and that goes Germany. France. Wait. What? 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 Alright. Small business grants. Protection is terrorist. Oh, can't do that one yet. Oh, that sucks. 59 senators. We need one more senator. Oh, God. House of support is so bad, though. It's so bad. Okay, well, we'll keep going down this way, then. Deregulate the economy. We get more popular to anarcho oh, anarcho capitalism. Reassure Congress. That's actually pretty good to do, probably. Decrease mega corp satisfaction. Of democracy of wealth. Cause panic within federal and state legislatures. Well, reassure Congress first. Probably the smart thing to do. Actually, all but, like, the cavalry is, it's okay, it's not bad. All but you, give me half of y'all and just convert to this, it's fine, whatever. Because, I'm going to do this, boom, bing, bong. Um, there you go. Solution, and just do this. Makes it easier, don't want to deal with it later. Increase minimum wage, it's going to decrease a lot of people. Small businesses will go way up, though. 
Promote business elites. Decrease large business satisfaction, which is not great. Mega corporations, though. How do we have a small guy? This one's not bad. Increase minimum wage. Small business goes down by 15%. You know what? We'll increase minimum, minimum wage. Why not? We need a lot more House of Representatives members, though. Oh, boy. And the riots. Workers... Oh. Well, we're trying to help them out as much as possible. Arms purchases. Nice. 39. Eh, it's close, so close to 39. Let's go with this one for sale. That'd be fine. Worker satisfaction 30%. Corporate, small businesses is okay. Let's deregulate the economy. We'll see what happens with this one. That's a lot of good consumer goods, though. Might be best to wait because we've got 32% and it makes it harder to get some stuff done. Oh, I'm talking uh, superior firepower. I do prefer a grand battle plan, but I haven't gone down this path in a while, so we'll go down superior firepower. Why not? Focus on the little guy. Oh, there's 60%. That's not bad. 35% for mega corporation, though. Hmm. Small business is not bad. Massive infrastructure. Yeah, you must keep doing this one. Increases everyone's relations. Uh, maybe I should have went down here faster. And the riots, but... Oh, maybe not. Actually, this is not even... You don't even have to do this one. Which is pretty bad to get, actually. Ignore the depression. I like that one. I like that one a lot. Panic within the federal legislature, huh? Just ignore people. That's what I do. Deregulate the economy. Very nice. Ignore the depression. <laughs> it's all in your head. Just don't be depressed, guys. Oh. Oh, and also Spain did win their civil war as well. Mm, we need way more house me members, though. What, so who's, who's in a faction? So we have the Commonwealth of Nations. Oh, the Czechs here. Germany's doing okay-ish. Commonwealth of Nations. Basically, the British Empire without Britain. You guys are struggling down here with these guys, though. That's not good. Fourth International, of course. Commonwealth. Gator. China's still holding on, though, surprisingly, but for now. We'll see how long they last. Uh, special measures. Okay, that's good. We need more House members. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, don't really want to do that one yet. Uh, special members. 50. And we'll do that one right now. Ooh, oh, yeah, the backers are done. Nice. Got quite a bit of command power. Ignore the depression. Mexican oil nationalized. Poverty Foundation. Why not? Hernan Labrador has uh, been stirring up populist nonsense aimed at our economic interests in Mexico. And now the Partido Communista Mexicano has passed legislation to nationalize the assets of Royal Dutch Shell, Standard Oil California, and many other international oil firms. Although the Constitution allows this action, international justice demands compensation for the losses suffered by the firms. The old baron demand we act. Our options are limited and force of arms must be considered. Um, I kind of want to do that one. But then again, I do want to see what happens when we do, like, destabilize Mexico for real. So it's probably best to not go to war with them yet. Oh, free Mexico exists. Oh. Well, we'll embargo them. I think it'd be best to do that, so, for now. Just because I do want to do that later on. Mexico needs to exist for that one, right? I oh, we'll see. We need to private mercenary legions. We need privatized defense. Good God. Um, yeah, I want to do, I want to do tank stuff, but is it really worth it? Is it really worth it? It might be. But, all right, so 40, 30, worker satisfaction. Who cares, right? Hmm. Eh, I'll do that one. Why not? We still get actually a decent amount of political power. Statehood would be okay. Medium lobbying. Eh, I'll do medium lobbying for now. And promote business elites. Decreases large business. And there are 40%. Eh, I want to wait. Yeah, this one's really good to do, though. Just infinite infrastructure. Infinite infrastructure. Why not? And 40. No, so 39. Get some more output because we need it. Because America's just kind of hanging out for now. Need more guns. Anti-air's not bad to get, though. Go with support equipment. We need way more support equipment. Actually, I'm going to put you underneath. We need more guns, too, but whatever. Whee! Poverty Foundation. Just don't be poor. And uh, democracy wealth. So it cause a slight panic. Work for satisfaction goes down. It's alright. Don't worry about it. Don't think about it. It doesn't exist. If you don't think about it, it can't hurt you, right? Out of context, that sounds really bad. But don't ask it. Don't ask questions. This is our America. Our ANCAP America. 39, grab some engineers. No. It's just construction speed. 
Oh wow, we're building quite a bit. Holy crap. That's actually really nice. We'll probably have to go to war with Mexico eventually though. Oh! Sanders votes for co proposal. That's nice. I mean, I prefer, uh... Oh, well, good job, Spain. I would prefer... I can't remember what I was going to say. Infrastructure is okay, but it does give us more resources, which I do want, so... If we run out of things to build, which we will run out of things to build eventually, like... America is such an industrial drug or not, it doesn't even matter. Uh, just keep building all this stuff, that's fine. Democracy of wealth. Oh, they joined the first international... Italian diplomatic isolation. Ensure governor loyalty. Privatized defense. Oh, any more supporters. Remove fierce regional opposition. Oh, wow. Extensive strike bribes. Um, is there anything... Ooh, 70 days, that's not bad. We can do this. Why is everything 70 day focuses? Ah, oh, why? Why, is there, why are they all 70 days? Uh, we have to, we'll ensure... Do we have fierce regional loyalty? Democracy backsliding? No, I mean, that'll pop up soon. I... Uh, I always go to the left route here. Um, combined bomber offenses. I don't... Well, that's not bad. It's not really worth it, though. Range. I don't even use strategic bombers, though. So, and these are just research blueprints, which is not bad, but... I guess we'll go with this one first. 45. Oh, worker satisfaction is pretty bad. Eh. Okay. Man. Hmm. Hopefully we keep that amount of support we currently have. Actually, do we have... Is anyone else at the war? Spanish Empire does look really good when they annex Portugal. I love that so much. Cannons. No, we can't send volunteers, huh? No. You can't do not allowed. God dang it, America. Get involved in other people's stuff. Oh, they support the president of policy? Nice. Very good, actually. Very, very good. <clears throat> artillery. Better artillery is so good to get. Now get one thing of... Oh, actually, you know what? Don't even make... Don't even buy stuff from people. We'll make it ourselves. There you go. It's a little better. Uh, a low worker satisfaction. No one cares. That one too. Oh, hello. Who is this? Mexico? Mexico? Bro? What's going on? Um, an atheist state. Well, okay. Well, let's stop training then. Because <clears throat> it looks like we'll have to fight the Soviet Union too. And we'll have to go to war. <coughs> Excuse me. Relatively early. Which won't be bad for us. But look at all that business federation support. That's very nice. Oh, privatized defense. There we go. We get private armies. Oh, holy crap. We get way less recruitable population factor. Though. Oh, well, I like no one there. Um, I'm not sure we can really do that yet, but we'll probably ensure governor loyalty. Where's the fierce regional opposition? It's a good question to ask. Recruit mercenaries. Well, let's use our guys like normal first, probably. Maybe deal with that. All right, do you have any upgrades? Eh, they're all, these guys are all right. How strong is Mexico, actually? We don't have any planes either, do we? I kind of deleted a lot of the planes. Um, we should have some. I think they're in Hawaii? Yeah, they are. There you go. There you go. Take one, two. Go there and take another one, two. Go there as well. There you go. That's a little better. So when you alls are done... Go do something like that. Air support's nice. And, oh, I knew that would happen. Crap, that's not good. Go eat that too. Um, I don't want to do that one yet. Yeah, especially if we we're going to go to war. I don't lose their population just yet, so... Do Ocean Navy Act? With the war on horizon, we must assure that no enemy can ever set foot on American shores. Our Navy must be able to fight any enemy in either of the two great oceans or former borders. Pretty much. And we'll get more support later on. It's fine. Let's focus on the little guy. Ah, we're kind of okay. Oh. Well, they clear war in Honduras. I left me some of them boys. Over there. Well, they... Didn't we guarantee them? Yeah? Uh... Yeah, they're going to war with all these people here. Do we not... 
Can we not? Oh, we can create a faction with these guys. <clears throat> that would kind of screw the folks here, wouldn't it, though? So... Do we not? We, we, we guaranteed them. But they, they just went straight to war. So... Is that... Is that bugged? I don't mind creating a faction, but we have our own faction to create. Oh! Well... I'm sure I'll, oh, of course, they do have the Axis. Yeah, I was going to say, this is not really balanced, but then again, these guys joined as well. Huh. Actually, can I help support China? Darn it. Cross in Slovenia. Of course, Yugoslavia does exist, so. Um, these guys, you, Germany, you probably don't want to go to war with anyone else just yet. Probably not. Let's, just, let's be real. Commando. It's not bad. Division of attrition goes down. I like that idea a whole bunch. More ANCAP stuff. I mean, we're already at 65%. That's pretty darn good. Better consumer goods. Disperse industry. Um, actually, can we actually throw on? Actually, for these guys. How much artillery do we have? We don't have enough. Chris has a present. Of course they would. Why wouldn't they? More infrastructure projects are fine. War propaganda against the Reich. We're going to stay to Hawaii. Why not? We'll, we'll do that one. <clears throat> well, I guess we'll just ensure Governor Loyalty next. Might as well, right? Oh, yeah, we have all these radio thingies. So, uh, let's see. Nope. Nope. Stay the grace. It's fine with me. And with some coffee here, too. Keep us nice and warm. They join the French. Oh! What? This is a very messed up timeline. Oh, they're going more commie. Also, the Yugoslavia and Ireland. Okay. I mean, I would say that's necessarily better for Germany, but... Still? But stills? What else we got here? Focus on the little guy. Prisoners of elite. War sport would be nice. We got more of this stuff, too. Yorktown class. Super heavies. Yeah, we got enough of this now. It's nice. Nice. And I do that, and then grab some more secondary batteries. Just, there you go. I don't want you to be too slow, but you're slow enough anyways. Cruiser holes. This will last the entire campaign, so. Oh, get up some from the trucks. And keep making more refiners if you can. <clears throat> Let's see. One, two, three, four. Uh, you go up by two, because we're going to throw one more here, too. In Illinois. That'll make it work. Um. after that one we probably want to do income tax reform we need more house members right yeah we need two more rep house of representative members so special measures yeah just do that one it's fine 270 is good so let's do this one income tax reform which we lose supporters but that's okay and they're going to privatize defense since no one wants to go to war with us and we'll see what happens Yeah, we don't have a lot of arty. We definitely use more arty. Standard officer support from Colorado. Do that one anyways. I'll make a lot of good points. Munitions plants. Yep, they're going all the way down now. They said Missouri. Where, where, was it Missouri? Oh, Colorado, my bad. Goodbye. 39, that's all good. More rubber. When you have those factories and such, that'll be good. Massive infrastructure project. <clears throat> Excuse me, I keep clearing my throat. Because there's always something in my throat. <clears throat> that sounds really weird out of context. Anyways, uh, income tax. After income tax, privatized defense. Might as well. Well, once we can get enough supporters, of course. But we should be able to. Should. 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 Yeah. An ethical institution. Congress will be transformed into a purely ceremonial body. Nice. Anti-air, A. Eh? Anti-tank would be nice. Go and grab that one, though. That's, that'd be good. Save our political power for now. Uh, actually, we'll do that one first. Make it, sure everyone likes us. Uh, we'll get more support. That, oh, hello. <coughs> Are they... They just keep justifying against other people, man. 
Watch a bunch of commies. Nothing worse than a commie. Oh, they actually did really well on, during Commonwealth. Capitulated. Czechoslovakia. They're still struggling. The UK has actually invaded Normandy. It's kind of cool. Kind of cool. It's definitely slow going. Can we actually send you an attaché? No. You guys, you guys. We need more political power. Which actually we might do that next. Will these guys even accept? Thompson's. Cool. Then again, if we're at war, we don't get to do anything else, but still. Um, not bad, not bad. Because you're, you're constantly at war. Sitting you not attaché would probably be good. They would not accept, though. Okay. What do you mean, misconduct? Oh, well, there goes Germany. They're probably going to die. Poland, would you like an attaché? No. Okay. No, no one like us. Oh, god dang. Screw you all in. Oh, any privatized defense. Let's see. Extend the tax breaks. We don't have enough support. God dang it. I knew this would happen. Well, that's the case. Maritime Commission? Oh, uh, Cass. Eric's P would be pretty decent to get. Bureau of Ships. Uh, remove Bureau of Ordnance. Oh, yeah. Well, that's not bad. We can do that one. We'll combine the Bureau of Construction, Repair, and the Bureau of Engineering into one entity to oversee future naval developments. While we're at it, maybe time to investigate rumors of inefficient torpedo performance, with the, which the Bureau of Ordnance so he vehemently denies. I'm in the budget. When removed. Well, we'll do that one. Why not? It's not going to last that long, right? Just long enough for us to get hurt. Oh, there goes Free India. Actually, how are the Japanese doing? Can you send you guys? I forgot about... Oh my gosh! Holy crap! They made a deal with the devil, didn't they? Let's see. Tache? No. No one likes anarcho capitalism for some reason. What's wrong with these guys? Wow. Germany, you really bet off maybe a little more than you can really chew. I mean, it's nice having your ally, the, you know, great British peoples and such. But good God. That's a lot of enemies to fight, and I don't think they're doing well. I might have to do some funky stuff. Just a concession? Oh, we only about this, please go right ahead. Excavation. Wish you aid them conditionally. Friends of democracy. Hmm. Hmm. Conditions. We're going to do conditions. They deny our demands. We're the U.S. and we're still walking away as winners. Nice. Sand oh, god dang it. Come on. 234. Extend tax breaks. Special measures. Yeah, do that one. Oh, come on. That's not enough. Extend the tax breaks. That's fine. Because we got more than enough Senate support. But we definitely need some House support. 234. Artillery is nice. I was just a lot of just sitting here just waiting for things to happen, but there's really not much else we can do. We got it. Pri privatized defense. Okay. They just keep going to war, which is actually... Oh, wait. Never mind. That's Britain. That's not good. All right. Grab more fuel stuff, even though we don't need it, really. Oh, hello. The Balkan Confeder League of Balkan Confederacies. There you are, but okay. Oh, well, th these guys are doing well over here, but the Axis is almost all the way over through here, too. So, you know, they're losing Austria, which is not very good for them. That's alright. Oh, well, I don't care what they do, huh? Excavation trace. 40. Got some of that too. That'd be nice. Barrow ships. When removed. 264 is not bad. Keep doing it anyways. We need it. Privatized defense. Just in time for the uh, Great Britain to... Oh! Ho whoa! Holy... All you had to have was that? Holy crap. That was fast. Privatize in defense. Oh, that blue... What the heck are these borders? What the heck? Bro, why? Why would you do it like this? Of course we could join the Axis. Oh. Bourbon, France. Extensive state bribes. Honestly, I don't see the point of this existing. 
Brittany's one thing, but like, bro, anything else here? It doesn't make any sense. And do they touch us at all? The axe is up here. Birth International. Axe is down there. Hmm. Alright, not bad. Panama joined. It's fine, whatever. Privatized defense. Follow it up with. Oh, we can actually get this one too. A research cell would be nice, but we probably have to do this one. We need. Oh, we need more support. Oh, come on. Business Federation. God dang it. Promises of Peace. Institute. Arr. God dang it. We keep getting hoodwinked by other stuff. Long Yun. Alright, Nicaragua. We might actually have to get Howard Hughes still in the end. Arr. Oh, private, private mercenary legions though. Okay. Oh no, it's going down. You know what? We only got so much manpower, so just... Um, that's as much as we can train. God dang it. Just keep them off for now. Just minimum wage. Medium lobbying efforts. Okay, that's good to get... Well, actually, that's not good. Because now you're barely going up now. Very not bueno. Very, very not bueno. Nicaragua's gone. Whatever. No one cares. Get up some of that. I get 1.23 political power every day. It's actually pretty nice. So, what we have to do is... Oh, I like to do that one, but Institute Press Censorship. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, it's not, oh we can't even do that one. Oh, yeah, we'll definitely, we have, definitely have to get this guy then. Because this is just barely going up. Or, we can say, screw you to democracy and cut it down. No, we can't cut it down. God dang it. Yeah, this is kind of gummed up, I guess, at this point. My bad, guys. Anti-air. Thank you. Oh, there goes those guys. Alright, so this is stuck for now. We need an ethical institution. We need more support for the Business Federation, though. God dang it. That sucks. Well, American Institute of Sciences. Universities and research labs all across the nation have so far conducted the research as they saw fit. It's got to end. Okay, new organization. Coordinate efforts of world-class scientists. Oh. Hey, uh, purchase emergency Mercenary Legion. Oh, we just bought big money. All right. So we definitely don't want that one. Ban fascism and communism. Well, they're barely here anyways. Yeah, we, we got to get that guy. So that, that really sucks. Um, in the end, we'll probably do a couple more of these uh, probably off screen just because we need more time to do stuff. Maritime Commission. Uh, that's not bad. Selective Training Act. We'll probably do that one too. The United States has historically been slow to adopt a draft. Even in times of war, we're no longer able to afford those luxury. These yen maneuvers. That uh, wouldn't be bad either. Budget constraints have us to observe many military developments from afar. Now we can finally try out some of our theories and practice. Maybe we'll support Rock Island. Uh, Cass effort. That's not bad. Those two. And then we will take out Mexico in the, by the end of this campaign. Limited intervention. Oh, you know what? Let me do that one too. It would take an extraordinary aggression to draw us into a full war of the full force, but uh, after recent developments, maybe people are freely willing to assist in conflicts abroad. But I think I'm going to do more of this off screen to make sure that we can get to where we need to be. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when we will, of course, fully ready go to war, hopefully, and see what else this mod has in store for us. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.